Good morning, everybody. I'm Dharma, and this is going to be your love tarot reading for Libra, Gemini, and Aquarius for the weekend ahead. All right, next couple of days. I only have a couple of decks in here, so that's Bodhi back there. My dragons are in the bed with me. All right, welcome to my nice, warm, cozy little spot. It's very cold out this weekend. What do we have coming in for Libra, Gemini, and Aquarius? The link for the extended will be in the box below to Vimeo, or you can join us on members where we do the dailies and we hang out and all of the things. So, Six of Wands and the Devil. Somebody's dangling a carrot, <clears throat> but fun fact, I think you can have the carrot, okay? There's also this energy here of this person. The Six of Wands is victory. It's public recognition. It's all kinds of good things, right? But this bird, okay, the hummingbird um, symbolism in divination is uplifting of spirit, a rapid response, um, just uplifting in all kinds of ways. And it's like she's feeding this hummingbird. She's Somehow or other, she's got this, she's driving this hummingbird. So what does that even mean, right? It means that whatever it is that this person is doing, they're driving the, 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 the lightness of being, the lifting out of a, a negative place. It just could be stuff that you're saying. It could be, um, actions that you're taking, just whatever it is that she's doing, she's working in tandem with the hummingbird, which means that she's behaving as such. And there is, it's very, very, very tempting. Whatever this, this is devil energy. Okay, this could be Capricorn. Um, Six of Wands is a fire sign. It doesn't matter. Somebody could be wearing red. <clears throat> and whatever it is that sh this person is doing is causing the other person to kind of stop and look. It's delicious. It is. This also could be about competition. Like, look at how easy it is for them, but I don't think so. I think it's more like, I love this. I'm obsessed with this. Look at them looking. They can't stop looking. It's becoming something they have to have. It's delicious. It is. It could also be primal. All right, devil energy doesn't have to be nasty and bad you have devil and then you have i guess the opposite of that would probably be judgment right lightness and dark yin and yang earth and ether okay so this reaction that is stemming from this person doing all this work to be just a light airy being it's probably waking them up in a primal place earth things lust desire yes Got to have it, must tangibly get. And um, it looks like they're going to do that. Okay. So over the weekend, somebody's doing something right. Being all six of wands about it. And um, we have someone who could potentially be a painter or an artistic person, or they have this thing they are working on, painting, they are, it doesn't have to be, what does it mean to paint in divination? To create something? And there's all these like butterflies around. It's just the air of change, butterflies, the change. That's probably this, right? doing all of the things to make the change. It's also the Eight of Pentacles, so we've probably been waiting a minute for whatever this is. And then finally, we have this um, Knight of Swords, which is typically a text, okay? Some kind of communication out of nowhere. It's She wasn't certainly wasn't looking for it, right? She's doing whatever. I'm just saying she because it's a girl, but someone, the person who's receiving the information is just working, doing whatever it is that they're doing. And... <clears throat> It looks like this message that comes in is light as a feather. Hi. 
Easy peasy, easy like Sunday morning. All right, I want this to move faster. Tell me about the text. It doesn't have to be a text. It's some kind of, it's the Knight of Swords. And I typically always see swords as communication. Sword. And the Wheel of Karma. Dharma, then karma. And this says cut to the chase. That's my point right here. It says cut to the chase. When I saw this, I'm like, I want this to go faster this time. Maybe you guys do back and forth, blah, blah, blah. And the conversation takes forever when really you want to get to something else. This is divine inner. This is a cycle. You do this all the time with this person. Dharma, karma is destined. It's inevitable. And I heard um, somebody on the tarot land say spiritual bait. If you're supposed to learn a lesson with someone, you're going to be so attracted to them that you just can't get enough with this. So if your lesson is from the ether, you must react in the earth to connect, right? Earth and ether. All right. So they come in, they want to like cut to the chase. <laughs> I bet they do. <laughs> That's the lovers. You guys might, um, as soon as you see them, you might grab up on each other. You guys could both be wearing black pants. You might grab your arm, not in a bad way, but like, that's so weird. Look at how he has her arm. Oh my God. I just saw the uh, image of on Dirty Dancing when she puts her arm up and he's all, and he does it all slow and it tickles her and she can't fucking stand it. It feels like that. It feels, but see, she's got those butterflies all the way around her. She might be just feeling butterflies in her belly about this person or about this situation or whatever, because in every single image, it talks about this flutter. And, and they are six of pentacles. They are absolutely pouring into you. Maybe even pushing a little bit harder because this teapot would pour on its own, but he like jumped on it to pour harder into this. I think that's what that was about before too, where he's like, I want to cut to the chase and get this thing rolling, right? I saw the hermit and the 10 of cups. They, I'm sure they enjoy whatever, but they miss you. Six of pentacles is the giving. And Ten of Pentacles. This person, wow. I heard inevitably. And I think this card says that too. It does. Inevit inevitable. That's a terrible word. In inevitable. <laughs> this I heard this person plans to do this inevitably. That is a terrible, terrible word. <laughs> That's great news, right? They, whoever this is, they're into you, man. Didn't, wasn't that the reading uh, earlier this week? They want you, period, right? You, This might all be taken care of in a series of eight messages back and forth. This is plans. She's ready for it. And Nine of Cups and Queen of Pentacles. Yep. <laughs> it does feel like that. It's a yep. It's a yep for me. It's a yep from them. Whatever. Nine of Cups is, it's all of the yays. But this person, she might be queenly. I don't remember what era or centuries the big poofy necks were. You guys could have a past life from that era. 
but she could also, someone here could also have neck pain. Someone could literally be wearing a neck brace, which I hope not. But her smugness, okay, this, her fan is made out of the nine cups, okay? Her smugness and glee when she gets this message is completely transparent. Everybody knows. Okay, she's just stupid happy. She's been asked to be the queen of pentacles. Be my girl. They might listen to like really loud music or something like that, but they, you're, wow. Maybe that's what the, the, the harder push was about. They're going to push it a little bit harder to um, pour into this. If there's other people around, either of you, they're not getting anything at all. They're pushing all of this into you. This is asking you to be their queen of pentacles. <laughs> I bet. I bet. <laughs> Queen of Pints, I bet. <clears throat> Are you gonna be my girl? Uh, 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 uh. What song is that? Tell you about the. Woo. Black Widow. <laughs> womp womp. The Black Widow is, this is a, this person could have Aquarius in their chart. But they, they might be, that's what I'm saying. They're planning on doing this. It's inevitable, whatever this is. And it's like a web. They want to make sure that they're putting a, a, a web around you. But that's not, is that bad? I mean, this person is coming to you with devil energy. They are. And it's happening right now. They, this is, um, but the other thing about the spider is that they, I'm not really sure what's good about a black widow. They're scary. They might, this person might have toxic traits and you might see it right away. Like you're going to, but, but like deep down in their psyche, you know what I mean? Like maybe they have abandonment issues or codependency or, or whatever. I don't think she cares. The happiness and the smugness on this. So what is that saying? That someone's like, all right, but everybody has issues. Okay. The fucking bug just ruined this entire reading. Ah, and then you have the convertible, which talks about things being adaptable. And crew, I mean, you can, whatever. You see, that stupid bug. <laughs> Taking it off the board. We get it. They come with devil energy, but so do you because you're attracting it. And what does that mean? You guys are on the same vibe. What else does it mean? You have an earthly lesson to learn, right? They're coming forward and asking you for something more stable or just kind of, it feels like they're just kind of making it clear. Like, look, they got the four of pentacles. They just want to like wrap it up. Let's just get this whole thing. See, they're, they're busy. They're an emperor. They would very much just like to wrap this thing up so that they don't have to whatever. <laughs> and strength. And plus they miss you and they want to pour into you. Like they would love to be, I think that if you have laid with this, snuggled with this person before, you might wrap your arms all the way around them and like actually hold them. And they just love it. They would love to just be able to lean on you whenever they want to. And they're sick of all the, all of the, the eight of pentacles waiting. Okay. So they come forward and they ask somehow or other, we're going to get to that in the extended. They ask for you to be their queen of pentacles. Let's just 
wrap this thing up so we don't have to worry about it, okay? All right, let's get to an extended and see what they do after that. The link for that will be in the box below. And um, until next time, I love you guys. Bye.